Hi guys, my name is Kai Tresset and today I want to speak with you about the new MacBook M3 Max and yeah, I think this video will help you to make your decision which configuration you should take. So I have uh, the same project with Ableton in all three computers. One is the 16 core, one is the 14 core and this one is my old uh, M1. And uh, my old M1 is able to play 40 tracks without crackling. This computer here is able to play 64 tracks without crackling. And this computer here is able to play only 60 tracks without crackling. But the big thing is that this computer, which would uh, was able to play 64 tracks in Ableton, is the 14 core. So it said actually uh, a Geekbench for multi-core only for 19,300 and this one is the 16 core, the more expensive, I think it's about 300, uh, 600 euros more expensive and it has a multi-core power of 21,000. So I don't know why it's worked like this, but uh, it looks like that uh, the 14 core is the better one. <laughs> And the cheaper one for making music and just for an example how much stronger these uh, m3 max are this is my m1 pro and this is only able to play 40 tracks so 40 tracks against 64 on the 14 core and against 60 on the uh, 16 core so, if you know why this is happening, every setting is the same, every configuration is the same. These are both brand new computers. I don't know what's happening. If you know, please explain me. Otherwise, wait, maybe other people make the same test and came to the same conclusion. And yeah, go for the 14 core. Thanks a lot.